<clears throat> Hi. Hi everyone. How you doing YouTube? How you doing my subscribers? I've had some... There's a reason why I haven't been doing videos lately. Only posting the video where uh, I went to Evanescence concert. Those are only videos. And African Life. And <clears throat> IMVU. Well. I've been taking a break from card reading. And taking a break from doing videos. Because I've been trying to find out my purpose in life. And I found, I found out my purpose in life. If, if you see me looking, I'm looking to see if the bus is coming. And I keep hearing a horn. Somebody honking a horn. I'm like, what the heck? Okay. There's some things that I hear, I hear in my sleep, but I can't really say, I can't tell anyone what it is. I have to keep it secret. I can't really tell anyone what I hear. I hear a lot of things. I hear a lot of things that I have to make sense, that make sense of it, because kind of, I don't know how to explain it. I don't know who's communicating with me. Probably my ancestors or beings from Sirius. I have no idea. I really don't know who it is. And the reason why I'm looking away because I'm trying to think of what I need to say I need to work on my uh, I need to work on my throat chakra I have a problem with communicating I really do not like being on camera I really don't but sometimes I have to I have to work on my self confidence I have, I have been feeling a lot of weird stuff lately. Every time I'm near my twin flame, like when I go to her concert, I get lightheaded and don't know why. I'm trying to figure out if there's any other twin flames that are going through the same thing when they're near their twin flame. I have a question for you. If you're going through the twin flame journey, when you're near your twin flame, do you... Do you feel lightheaded or do you get like this feeling like you're going to black out but not really black out? You just get lightheaded around them. And then and then she said some speech before the song Lost in Paradise. She said something about she was talking to the fans and she was saying that um, I want to give some, I think she said, I want to give uh, you and I uh, permission to fall apart or something like that. Something about falling apart. And then all of a sudden the song started. And then I started feeling all this love like towards the middle of the song, like almost towards the end of the song. I started feeling this love like coming over me. And, and I felt it in my heart chakra. I also felt this feeling in my solar plexus, but it was more in my heart chakra. But also, I also felt some, some feeling in my solar plexus, which uh, fear started to come in. But I told myself, you know what, just let it happen. Let it happen, don't fight it no more. And sure enough, when I stopped fighting it, 
I started feeling this love coming inside my heart, my heart chakra. And that was her sending her love to me. I don't know how she did it, but she did it. And she was... She was sending her love to me. And out of nowhere, I started crying. Like, I just couldn't control the crying. And, and I just was crying. I had tears coming out my eyes like, like, oh my God, is this what love feels like? And I was really happy and I was like, wasn't feeling like, like I wasn't getting any love. I just felt like this is love from the divine that she's sending me. And that this is the love that I've wanted to feel for so long that that's the love that I was looking for. And that's the love that everyone is looking for. And that's all I wanted to say. There's more things I want to say, but I can't get it out at the moment. Like I said, I have to work on my throat chakra and self-confidence. I really don't have that much self-confidence, so I am working on healing my chakras. I already figured out how. I already know how we can get closer to the divine. I figured it out. I've been getting messages in my sleep about it. Um, it's about the chakras, the seven chakras. I really cannot, uh, I really can't talk about it because I'm a little. I'm a little nervous, a little shy, maybe a little teeny bit shy. Ah, one moment. Okay. 